All right, time to talk sports now. Gonzaga guard Joel Ayayi announced this afternoon he is officially declaring for the NBA draft. Karthik Venkatraman is joining us now with more on his reaction as well as those who know and love playing with him. Hi, Karthik. Hey, Whitney. How's it going? Yeah, Ayayi declaring for the NBA draft really isn't that surprising after the season he had. It was expected, and this should be a good movement for him as he locked himself in as an NBA draft pick with his play this year. Ayayi averaged 12 points per game on 57.5% shooting. He showed us the ability to cut to the basket without the ball to get himself easy buckets. The guard also shot well from the three-point line, shooting at a 38.9% clip. Ayayi was a good rebounder, averaging 6.9 per game. That's the most in a season ever by a guy. Zaga guard. He had the first triple double in program history when the Zags played Portland on the road in January. He's expected to go anywhere from the late first round to somewhere in the second round in the NBA draft. The Yai released a statement today and he said my four years at Gonzaga have been unforgettable and some of the most special times in my life. And then he also said to the fans, you will always hold a special place in my heart and I'm honored to be a Zag forever. Several teammates from last year or this past year's team uh, posted on Instagram about Ayayi's decision. Corey Kispert said, one of the best to do it. Proud to call you my brother. Aaron Cook said, my brother for real. Can't wait to see what God's got in store for you. And then Julian Strother said, my brother, like we've got the same mom. I love you, boy. And then his former teammate, Killian Tilly, and fellow Frenchman said, it's time. So, you know, a lot of people excited for Joel as we move forward along here. Ayayi, who was a retro this past season came a long way in his four years at Gonzaga before GU uh, played Creighton in the Sweet 16. Here's what head coach Mark Few had to say about just how far the guard has come along in this program. Always in either the practice facility or in McCarthy working out at varying hours uh, of the day. I mean if you think about where Joel was his freshman year uh, to where he is now I think is amazing. He brings an infectious enthusiasm with him and uh, he's really came a long ways, and 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 I, and I, I hey, I was one who when he first got here, I was just like, man, with that body, I didn't know how we were going to make him a functional, high-level Division One player, and he's so much more than that now. It's 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 right up there with the best of our uh, development stories. Of course, Ayayi was known as the team prankster too. He always kept it light by messing around with his teammates and playfully poking fun at them. He's definitely a personality to go along with the fact that he's a heck of a basketball player. Yes, he is. He will certainly be missed. It was always very fun to watch him play. Karthik, thank you very much tonight. Thanks.